All right, so here's my setup uh, supporting the engine up high, and then we're gonna be start working to take out this engine mount on the right side. So the socket you need to remove those bolts and the uh, one nut, what I use is a 15 millimeter socket. They're all the same. As you can see, I just cracked them loose, and after that, you just zip them off with the impact. And then there's three or four bolts down here that hold this mount to the block. You need to take those off. And those are 15 millimeter as well. We'll just, we're just gonna crack them loose and then we'll maybe use the impact. All right guys, so we're gonna have to use a good old ratchet to get this one out. You can't put a tool, impact tool in there. See that oil going in there? That's from this bulb cover oil. All right, there we go guys, it's out. Before we took, take out this belt, there's a tensioner right there. We'll take out this uh, tensioner, tension, that tension the belt off. I'll show you how I'm gonna do that. What you need is a strong arm, flexible head with a 16 socket, look like a star right there. And you're gonna put it in here and I'll show you how is that done. You turn this thing to, to the right, this uh, strong arm, and make sure to have a screwdriver ready to uh, put this in a hole. So pull the strong arm to the right. All right, my screwdriver is too big. All right, I got a pin here, and here we go. Just like that, okay, let it rest the housing and then you let it go get you guys really close up there there's uh, the pin you need has to rest on the housing there and now it's time to uh, take this belt off at this part you really don't need to take out those bolts and the uh, water pump pulley off uh, I'm doing a timing chain replacement on this that's why I'm taking that pulley off at this part, you can just slide the belt over on all those pulleys. Inspect everything. Make sure that uh, nothing that making the noise. All right. So I'm turning after inspection all this pulley. It looks like it. Looks like everything is sounds okay no noise so at this part this is a time to install a new super time belt or if you want you can replace that tensioner as well uh, you install them in the reverse order and that's it guys thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe i'll see you again on the next video